Now, 27 storm track weather with Chief Meteorologist Cameron Hopman. Well, that scattered rainfall on its way into southern Wisconsin over the last couple of hours. Pause in that imagery, our Doppler radar showing some of the heaviest of that rainfall north of Mauston right now. But look at out towards Richland Center, Fenimore moving in towards Dodgeville as well. Starting to see more of that rain push gradually eastward over the last little while. And that is evident now from our tower camera looking west from our station here on Madison's west side where we are seeing more of that cloud cover, a bit of a grayer sky, though conditions right now still not necessarily all that unpleasant. It's 62 degrees in Madison currently. That's down from 64. That was the high temperature earlier on today. Winds from the southwest, 17 miles per hour. The southerly winds, they're not going anywhere, at least not yet, and it is still blustery out there. Wind gusts today as high as 36 to 37 miles per hour in spots. In, in fact, over the last couple of hours, Fond du Lac as well as Janesville Monroe seeing about 36 to 37 mile per hour winds. Platteville about 37, clocking in 36 miles per hour here in Madison earlier on today as well. So it has been a windy and mild day across the area and temperatures will gradually cool. But if you are going to be out and about over the next couple of hours, you may want to have that umbrella ready to go. 62 degrees at 6 o'clock by 7 p.m. We're right around 61, uh, 60 degrees over the next about two hours here. So picking that future track back up by about 10. Notice more of that cloud cover. Chances of rainfall for the most part passing to the east of Madison by about 10 o'clock. You see some of the heaviest rainfall found a lack on towards uh, Watertown by that time. By the time midnight or 11 o'clock rolls around, the last of that rain's exiting. That should make for a quieter night ahead, though we still wake up to some scattered clouds early tomorrow morning as temperatures gradually dwindle back down into those upper 40s. 48 degrees, your morning low temperature in Madison. 49 at 7 by 8 o'clock. We're already pushing 51. We fast forward a couple of hours. We're actually seeing temperatures in the mid 60s. This is by our lunch hour. Look at this 69 in Watertown by then 65 in Lone Rock here in Madison. We reach a high temperature of 67 degrees just about 1 2 o'clock in the afternoon prior to the arrival of some more cloud cover and yes, another round of rain as well. Scattered showers, maybe even some rumbles of thunder, a possibility on Tuesday afternoon. The good news is the rain chances again, not necessarily widespread nor organized nor long lived. We'll deal with maybe some scattered isolated rain showers up until just about dinner time or so. And thereafter, we quickly dry out. Many of us barely looking at uh, one hundredth of an inch of total rainfall from this system as it passes on through. But some of us could see maybe up to around two tenths of an inch on the high end. So rain is in the forecast only for the rest of the night tonight and then again for tomorrow afternoon, early evening. Wednesday, at least we are dry. 52 year high temperature on Wednesday. Thursday reaching up towards 60 degrees. Winds are back from the southeast around 5 to about 10 miles per hour both days. Thankfully, looking at drier, quieter, less windy weather ahead for our midweek and our Thursday, though. Rain chances are back in the forecast for your Friday, your Saturday, your Sunday, and Monday. A little damp down the road. Temperatures will be warmer, though. Back up to 73 by Saturday afternoon. We had a couple good days here Ooh. yesterday and today. Yeah, honestly, uh, today was yeah. absolutely beautiful. That's and before really that nice. rain moves in tomorrow, it's going to be another nice day. So like things that. pretty comfortable as far as temperatures, yeah. at least for the time being. Okay, thanks, right, Cam. Thanks, Cam.